It's been a long time. PopOS, one of the most beloved Linux distributions which was popular among everyday users who wanted to use Linux not just for the customizability but for the reliability, the power. It was considered one of the best operating systems if you wanted to do gaming, editing or any type of creative work. It was reliable, stable and trustworthy. But then it vanished from the spotlight for a long time. You see, for years, PopQuest stood tall as one of the best Linux distributions for everyday users, productive users, creative professionals, and even gamers. It was built on Ubuntu. It was the go-to choice for many people who wanted power with polished desktop. It gave us the ability to change GPUs even directly from the desktop. But then things changed. System76 shifted their focus to something big, building their own desktop environment, Cosmic. Not just a shell tweak like before, they wanted a brand new desktop of their own written entirely on Rust. And ever since the update slowed, the last stable update of PopOS was way too long ago. And we saw scattered blog posts, the occasional alpha tease of the Cosmic desktop, but the silence was just so much. Maybe PopOS and System76 lost their momentum, but now at last the silence has been broken. The CEO, Carl Richel, has confirmed it himself that PopOS 24.04 Beta and the long-awaited Cosmic Desktop Beta are coming on 25th of September 2025. Now, the naming scheme is a little weird because PopOS 24.04, the naming scheme was usually reflected the year, but it is 2025 and the PopOS will be 24.04 Beta. Well, weird. But still, this is the first real public milestone in a long time, for the first time. The world will actually get its hand on Cosmic in its beta form directly on the Pop OS. And you might wonder, why is this important? Well, Cosmic is not just about looks, it's about independence. Writing an entire desktop environment inside Rust. System76 is stepping away from the limitations they had from GNOME. This gives them power to shape the whole operating system directly. The desktop, the insides of the desktop, it will be stable, sleek, customizable, and tightly integrated with the Pop OS ecosystem. It's not just about another update, it's a statement that System76 wants a defined and polished future of the Linux desktops on their own terms. And after years of anticipation, frustration, silence, this is the first time Cosmic will finally be real in the beta version. As for what's next will... Okay, Ryan. As for when the final release will drop, it's certain that it will be around like the end of the year, hopefully. Like rumors suggest it will be on November, but I believe it will be end of the year or maybe the very early beginning of 2026. Because we are hoping for a full test talk with a real at last pop OS release. And it's okay if it takes time because building a whole operating system and a desktop entirely on their own without relying on GNOME is truly magnificent and appreciable. So here we are. PopOS is still alive. Cosmic is nearly here. And for the first time in the longest time, the future of this pub- the future of this particular distro feels exciting again. Will Cosmic deliver the promise we had a long time ago? A trustworthy, everyday usage, productive and really powerful operating system which was considered the go-to platform for anyone who wanted power on their fingertips. Or maybe this time it will not be able to catch up with other distributions because it has been a long time. Just take this for example. The last update of PopOS 22 maybe? It was with GNU 42 and it still is. While other distributions are now on GNU 48. There's a big difference in almost 6 versions and it was a long time. Well, we'll find out soon. So, if you want to stay updated, make sure you are subscribed to my channel because I'll be covering Cosmic hands-on with the moment it drops. And if you want to watch more awesome tech videos uploaded on this channel daily, then, yep, you know what to do. Subscribe and check out the catalog of Linux videos I have on my channel. Yep, I know this video was a little short, but it was really important because my favorite distribution you see, let me just give you a story time, okay? A long time ago, when I didn't have a proper laptop, it was a very old laptop, maybe now 9 years old, I really wanted a gaming laptop and I had a wish that I'd install PopOS on it. 
I'll do video editing and most probably gaming on it. Because Poco is the was the best, the most polished, the best experience anyone could get on a powerful machine. But now, until the time I had a really nice laptop, I was able to afford it through my YouTube money. System 76 went dark. It had been an year since the last update of Pop OS, the official stable version. But at last, it's coming back. So yep, I have my hopes high. And let's hope this time, they're gonna actually do something crazy. Because the last time we covered Pop OS on our channel, it was about the Cosmic Desktop. And the Cosmic Desktop was not so good at the time. It had a lot of glitches, sort of smiley minor problems, but it was still okay. And I'm waiting for that awesome desktop. Well, I believe that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll meet you next video. Till then, I'm Oom signing out.